In today's story, I'll be telling you about a person who at considerable personal cost has been protecting forests. Hello, it's James from the Global Portrait Project, where I'm painting 193 portraits of 193 subjects, each from different countries, with each subject involved in a positive environmental action. And today it's the turn for country number 28, Burundi. The subject for my portrait for Burundi is Leonidis Enzigimpa, conservationist and forestry professional, along with being founder and legal representative of Conservation and Community of Change. Burundi is a landlocked country in the Great Rift Valley, where the African Great Lakes region and East Africa converge. It is bordered by countries beginning with R, T and D. Lake Tanganyika lies along its southwestern border. The primary environmental concerns in Burundi are the unregulated depletion of natural resources, including deforestation along with soil erosion, making the country more vulnerable to climate change exacerbated events such as flooding. Leonidis is committed to improving forests and the lives of local communities, women and youth in his country, Burundi. He is known for his tireless efforts, sometimes risking his own personal safety to boost biodiversity, conservation, food security and living standards for the local populations in his country. Leonidis has been targeted with physical violence many times in relation with his work of forest protection. The worst attack occurred in his office in 1994 when during an attempted murder he unfortunately lost an eye. Unlike many, none of this has deterred Leonidas from his lifelong passion for nature protection. Among other achievements, Leonidas led the first effort in the history of Burundi to involve indigenous people in sustainable forest management. He reached out to a community of 130 Batwa indigenous people who had been living on the streets of the city of Bururi in precarious conditions. Following guidance from Leonidas, they learned how to protect the forest and its wildlife. They earned a salary, formed an association, pooled their savings, opened a bank account, and eventually purchased three hectares of land on the Bururi Nature Reserve where they built their own houses and became the guardians of the forest. This experience is now being replicated in other protected areas of Burundi. Leonidis is also instrumental in improving education for children of Batwa indigenous peoples in such areas as ecology, restoration and sustainable forest management. Leonidis founded the association Conservation and Community of Change, known as the Three Cs, in 2019 in order to further involve the community in the protection of biodiversity. Leonidis has created national and international networks and has promoted the use of a computerised, standardised forestry management tool, which has greatly helped responsible forestry management spread throughout the country's protected areas. In 2018, Leonidas was awarded the prestigious Buffett Award for Leadership in Conservation. If you'd like to find out more about Leonidas and the CCC, I have put some links in the description below. Final words from Leonidas are 
Planting trees is also planting for the future. Protecting the forest and biodiversity is protecting life. There is more information about this painting and how to get involved with the Global Portrait Project on the website and Instagram page and the links are in the description below. Next time we'll be meeting someone living on a small island doing big work to help wildlife in Cabo Verde.